Walker is a super saiyan. Talk, trying to talk about nothing again in mind. Yep. Specifically, Captain Marvel. Okay, we've had it. Yep. Okay. Again, me and Chad's and, I, and I'm going to talk about the new issue of Shazam. Okay, issue one. Yep. If you want to talk about a good one, I'm a huge fan of Big Red Cheese. Yep, Captain Marvel is a big one. Yep. Two, I've been waiting for your time for a very, 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 very long time. Ever since he disappeared since then, he had Dark Side War. Which, you would know that by the way, how that time went. Meh. Meh. Best. Three, most of all, I want to know how Jack John does much because Jack at this time, and if you got kind of a DC new two crowd out of existence. Yep. And since I am a fan of the this will be more a critical review. Yep. So I join part on the ancient ancient issue of Shazam issue one. Yep, I can cut them all. See ya. Alright, um, as you can tell me inside, you can tell me ancient about this issue. Why? You'll find out. What's the story? The guy started at the end well in the subway with um someone there like what's the quote? Send the girl the lock returning with interview for all to approach. Yep. And the door will open to all in need. This great hall will overseen by the council of eternity, a group of seven wizards and sor sorceresses who took about to protect all magic. So seven sins were free by dark champion and all but one of the kind of sword. Yep. And we can see a bit of recap with the other new bit of Jordan. Yay! Has a uh, new, no more new video club, which that's not even point. Do next. We cut out to well, today to Philadelphia. Yep, the Museum of American Revolution. Yep. With um, the cheese and coat. Men who came from different parts of the co continent strongly disposed to despise and, qu and quarrel with each other would instantly become but one patriotic band of brothers. So you see, without General Washington, Quasar is a mega web remain in divide. <laughs> mega Washington, blah blah blah. This is so boring. I mean, interesting. But this is about history, Billy. Not, not just the history, this is a mega revolution. Besides, we're going to test on tomorrow. Mega one, I guess, would be the Germans. Yep. And it's the other for human. Yep. And you draw a bit of the world they attack the museum. And you get this, uh, m m cut them all. Yep. I put that cut the entire, the entire school. Well, the museum is that. It's pretty cool. But that awesome fat ass. Yep. Also, we get the mall fam as well. <laughs> Wait, that's pretty awesome, badass. Yeah, today you caught this quad, quad triple. You've been five, right? Six, but kind of spug over there. Yep. And we're just gonna kick the ass. Awesome. <laughs> that's cool. Anyway, they shot the robot and they get in with, with the cops. With uh, the cops there, quote. Okay, and that's how we all got everybody back in the butt. Have you ever seen Barry play? Bad job. Taking these bugs down. They've been hit in the museum across the city. Just need your name some information. Will you be on your way? Um, which one are you in charge? I am. And she cut them all in a million more watching Ridley Road. They said, who's in charge? I thought I was in charge. Well, I'm older. I was first. Why didn't you take a vote? I you from Mary. Hey! We really need code names. I'm strong as me. I should be with her. I'm the Call of Duty expert. I know about our strategies. When did you just pick a hierarchy? I feed the vote. Yep. And they leave. Yep. Meanwhile, back in the basket, family home, we get to see the entire family, well, back in the family. Which is pretty cool. And that's the end of point, Terry Troop. Next. And we get to the Rock of Virginia. With, um, what, what the mall family, well, main Rock of Virginia at the headquarters, which is pretty cool. Don't tell me what they're doing, but they're main superheroes. So, I mean, our trophy collection could use a little work. Tell me, Matt, that something that I qualify, but I get to something. Who came up with that? Oh, it's you, I can You, I can Yeah, I guess it's official. A name? A family. Hey, dog. I wouldn't trade you guys for anything. Aww. Yeah. You come with me and see what I got right now. And we get to see if they find this, this new, what is this new occasion. Honey, it's some old s s subway scene. It's pretty cool. And it connects to all these um old, we can't call them magic rants. What the magic lands? Uh, I don't know. I ain't good now, it's very true. Anyway, the rest of the, rest of the family, the two parents, well, old parents, I go to the store, and they see that they activate the power switch. And well, it turns out it's Billy's father. And that's uh, the common dance. Well, sort of. They had a backup story with Mary Marvel, it's pretty cool. 
which is pretty, actually pretty adorable. But the only thing to think about that story is the ending with that story, you know, that dude with Mary Marvel, like, and Doug going at you to go to the museum with the Captain Bunny, as you say. That's adorable. <laughs> and that's how the comic ends. Yep. Alright, um, as you can tell from my recap, that you can tell I found the issue was interesting. Why? You'll find out. Let's just start. Um, what sort of artist is it by, um, Eagle Sham? E Eagle Sham art is actually really good. Is it good, good friends out with? Um, it is. Sort of. Right. It, it's not a good game, but you know what? It, it, it's good art and I love it. All is beautiful, but look at the story itself. Okay, as you well know, I'm not buying New Fifty Two order. I hate New Fifty Two. New Fifty Two cut them all. It's a very bad one. We're awful. Like holy shit, New Fifty Two was a bad. It destroyed my favorite character, Big Red Cheese. That being said, though, after we this issue, what what what, what, what can I say? This issue is amazing. Improvement with the New Fifty Two guard because holy shit, like I I can't believe I'm saying it. Jeff John actually fixed that he cut them all. Where he be on character? He dropped my nighter. I'm a kinder, and a lot more at the sweeter, and at the after the camera, and run up from, from the gay from the Jeff Smith days. No, don't understand. It is book perfect. Haha, <laughs> no, I still have some problems. One, we're still maintaining the New 52 origin, which, why? It's Weaver. But like, forget the New 52. The New 52 died. Like, what that one did die off? But besides that little complaint, I will admit, though. The story actually is actually interesting in this time because well, while we still have the New 52 stupid origin intact, I will admit, this continuation of Captain Marvel's story is actually interesting because the rest of the Marvel family in this book is pretty cool and adorable. I love that moment. I'm happy about that. We gotta go to the Marvel family. Very underrated team in my opinion. That's one. Two, I still don't like these still not going to Captain Marvel, but whatever at this point, I give up. But I am happy they are family. Three, that ending at the with suppose Billy Island's father being alive, that could be either one, that could be either many things. My, my, my best guess, that cliffhanger, my best, you should think about it. I have a theory. My theory that I had actually missed the mind. Because, for you know, Mr. Mind never actually showed up in the review of 1752, so my best is probably Mr. Mind tricking basically the Vasquez into letting them actually bring the house. Now, do I think that's gonna be legit? Um, time will tell. Like I said, it's a slow burn, so we're not gonna get a lot of answers. But I'm always happy Jeff Johnny fixing his mistake and actually running at the event saying, as he, and actually fixing that damage from the Virginia Area, that garbage. And I'm the family, that'd be fun. That's what the Marvel family is fun and adorable. Now, that backup, that, that backup story in there with Mary Marvel dealing with her abusive family. Crap. <laughs> that was depressing. But I wish I had Mary Marvel and her uh, friend, you know, they were able to, to help Billy in the museum. But we get a little Easter egg with the little, like, little bunny. That's adorable. Like, that all said it made cute at all. That reminds me of a particular old Jack Smith style. But my, my friends, I mean, I actually love that artwork a lot more than the um, other artwork. But that's my opinion. Oh, I'm going to tell you about the number one issue. Yeah. Mm. Well, it was a good story, it was good to care about and care to, uh, King of Phoenix. So, I'm gonna win. Alright, now, with all that said, what do I give Shazam issue number one? I just can't know, but it's four out of five stars. Is it perfect? No. Is it a good story? Yeah. Is it good way back in the New 52? Oh, hell yes. This guy can feel a lot more when Shazam can cut them all and feel more at the end of the character. So, no, there's no bullshit. It's how you do cut them all or it's not right. Anyway, that's not what happened that Um, anywho. That's gonna be your Shazam, issue number one. Spoiler for you. Watch more on Pluto Connor Merch. Are you doing about this issue? Do you like it to it? Although, what do you mean, uh, Shazam at the return? And are you excited for his, his return in the DC Universe body? Pluto Connor Merch. Also, I'm gonna be following Twitter. Please follow my channel. Follow my Twitch. Follow my starter. Please click the bell icon. I'm gonna put you back to it you can. Now, Talk to you. Longer cut them all, longer play Batson, and longer the Marvel family. Woo. And I can't wait for issue two. Captain, <laughs> see ya. Bye. Longer cut them all. See ya.